Hey everybody, Jake here for American Trucks, and today I'm chatting with Derek about his 2007 Silverado 1500. Derek, thank you so much for being here with me. I'm excited to talk about your truck. Well, thank you for having me. I'm excited to uh, let you guys know about it. So you are driving a 2007 Chevy Silverado 1500 work truck, or WT as it's colloquially known. For wheels, you've got the Pro Comp 97 Series Rock Crawlers in gloss black. These are 17 by nines with a negative 19 millimeter offset, making for an aggressive stance. For tires, you're running the Goodyear Wrangler All-Terrains, and these are 265 70 17, so about a 31 inch tire, and you're running stock suspension. Derek, tell me a little a bit about what you did with this truck, kind of generally what your focus was with it when you got it. Uh, the focus really was just to make it look a little less than stock. I wasn't trying to go crazy, get it all like, lifted and giant tires and everything. A little less like skinny and all that. I wanted to put the tires out a little bit, give a different lighting on it so that it actually looked a little different than other uh, WTs out there. So these are the Pro Comp 97 series rock crawlers. They're gloss black and they are 17 by nines with that negative 19 millimeter offset. So you've got kind of an aggressive stance. So what drew you to this wheel when you were shopping for them? What did you like about it initially? Uh, the fact that they're just straight black. There's no, uh, I'm not a big fan of chrome personally. I'm eventually gonna replace the chrome rear bumper with a black bumper. Um, I just wanted it to be flat black, nothing fancy about the rims themselves. I don't need 22s with spokes and all that. Like. I just wanted a generic steel rim that I could beat the hell out of. So the, the old school circles and the or the circle cutouts in the rims, like that was exactly what I was looking for. So it took me a while to find them just because I, I was looking for something with a more aggressive stance. So it was like, it was just a lot of digging, like trying to find that specific rim, but with a, a heavier offset. So it wasn't like, oh, I'm just buying it and it's gonna stick it out like a quarter of an inch or something. I was actually wanting to get a little farther out and that's when I actually stumbled across them on the uh, on the website and I was like negative 19 that's about two inches out from where it was so it worked perfectly. So these are Goodyear Wrangler all-terrains pretty standard tire so they're 265 70 17 so this is the stock size that you had on the truck when you bought it right? Yep. So how have they been for you? Because you've obviously had them on the truck for a little while. How do they drive? Are they are they quiet? Do they have any bumpiness, any road noise to them really? I mean, surprisingly for uh, for what they are, they, they ride pretty good. Um, we've had ice storms in our state for the past couple of years and they, uh, I think they're down to about four or five, 30 seconds right now and they still grab pretty good. I didn't, didn't have any issues, didn't, uh, feel unsafe at all. Road noise is next to nothing with them, so. Tell me about some of your off-roading adventures with these with these wheels and tires on the truck. When you changed the stance especially, did you notice anything feeling different? Was it a little more stable when you were out on the trail? So I actually didn't take it out anywhere like inclement with the old rims on it actually. Uh, with the old inset and all that, like I pretty much kept it on the road until I got the new rims and then it was like, okay, I'm gonna take it up on a mountain see how it handles on the trail there. And the tires being bald didn't help, but I think the stance did, because it, it kind of helps it keep a little bit more stable, especially when you're you're doing hairpin turn on a dirt road going up a mountain. It's kind of kind of helps keep it from tipping a little bit. I want to talk briefly about the suspension because this is a stock truck. You haven't done anything to the suspension yet. Did you have any fitment or rubbing issues with them? No, oh, no, actually. I, uh, um, I actually work at a shop, so I was able to put the tires on, kind of test it, turn the wheel and everything, uh, put one on the back, bounce the suspension, make sure nothing was rubbing or anything. What, what else is next? I know the 33s are gonna happen. What are you kind of gravitating towards? All terrains, mud terrains, something that's a little bit more streetable. What, what are you thinking about? I'm going chunky. <laughs> something with a lot of, uh, a lot of really thick tread on it, something that I could actually take out on some decent trails and hopefully get the, uh, the truck muddy and maybe a little broken. So do you have any plans to do suspension mods in the future? Probably eventually, uh, depending on how the 33s fit, I might put a uh, at least a two inch on it. What if anything outside of that are you thinking? A paint job actually. So I was actually looking at a, uh, eventually getting it in forest service green. I was really hoping when you said paint job, you were gonna say forest service green, because I think that would look absolutely awesome. Yeah, I've been, uh, I've been wanting some kind of vehicle in that color. Basically ever since I was a little kid, I'm like, I'm getting a vehicle in that color eventually. I do um, eventually want to get a bully bar on it. So I do have a, uh, um, a, basically a little tiny brush guard at work from one of our trucks. And I just have to weld the brackets up and all that, put it on there and mount it up. So 
that's another thing for the future. All right, well, Derek, thank you so much for being here and chatting about your truck with me. For everybody who's watching at home, Derek is driving a 2007 Chevy Silverado 1500 WT. For wheels, he's running the Pro Comp 97 series rock crawlers in gloss black. These are 17 by nines with a negative 19 millimeter offset, making for an aggressive stance. For tires, he's running the Goodyear Wrangler All-Terrains, and these are 265 70 17s, so or about a 31 inch tire, and his suspension is stock. So Derek, thank you again for being here with me today. Thank you all for watching, and as always, for all things Silverado, be sure to keep it right here at americantrucks.com.